Hi everyone, it's Schematic Matt and today we are going to talk about testes and epididymis. Two oval organs called the testes produce spermatozoa and a male hormone called testosterone. Each testis is enclosed by a fibrous capsule called the tunica albuginea. Tunica albuginea creates septa into the tissue of the testis and divides the testis into lobules. Each lobule has coily structures which are seminiferous tubules. Spermatozoa are formed in the seminiferous tubules. They open into a network of channels called the reti testis. The reti testis is connected to the epididymis by efferent ductals. The coiled and compacted duct of the epididymis forms the epididymis. The epididymis has a head at the superior part, a body in the middle, and a tail. Sperm cells are transported from the reti testis to the epididymis through afferent ductules. Tail of the epididymis becomes the ductus deferens or vas deferens, which is a tiny muscular tube in the male reproductive system that carries sperm from the epididymis to the ejaculatory duct. 